Hello everyone, in today's video we are going to talk about watercolor sketchbooks that are made with 100% cotton paper. So these are the ones that I have, I'll go through them one by one and talk about their pros and cons and where you can find them online. Some advantages of using 100% cotton watercolor paper is it's so much easier to use wet on wet techniques on such paper. For example, if you want to blend colors into one another subtly, gradually, very smoothly, such as what I have here and here, on such paper, it's so much easier. If you want to paint gradation, if you want to have the colors blend into the white of the paper, if you want to charge in some additional colors while your initial wash is still wet, you can do so very easily on such paper. The second advantage is Cotton paper is durable, so when you paint multiple layers on it, the paper fiber will not come off the surface. The third advantage is it's easier to lift colors off such paper as well. So if you want to remove some color, you can actually add some water or use a brush to scrub off the color. And because the paper is durable, you can scrub off, remove the color without damaging the paper too much. So these are the three main advantages when it comes to using 100% cotton paper that you don't usually get with non-cotton paper. Sketchbooks with 100% cotton watercolor paper are quite rare. They are not easy to find. Sure, you may find sketchbooks that use 25% cotton or mixed cotton content, but the paper in those sketchbooks, they are actually not very different in quality compared to non-cotton paper. So in today's video, I want to show you some options for really high quality watercolor sketchbooks. And the first one that I have here, this is the Sketchbook Pro made by this company called Covell in Italy. This sketchbook is made with Fabriano 100% cotton watercolor paper, has 56 pages. The paper weight is 300 GSM. This is acid free, durable, archival, and handmade. They also have another version that comes with 50% cotton and this has 72 pages. These two sketchbooks were sent to me by the company. I just received them yesterday, so I haven't got a chance to test them yet. But with Fabriano 100% cotton watercolor paper, you can expect the quality to be good. So this looks like a very nice sketchbook. The build quality, the binding looks terrific. There is this rubber band here which is removable this is great because certain sketchbooks they have those elastic rubber band that is stitched to the sketchbook and those elastic bands they will lose their elasticity over time and it's going to look very ugly i'll show you one later on but this you can remove it and this is i think a smarter move so we have cut off corners here, which is interesting. Usually we have rounded corners, but this is cut off. And for the pages that are inside, they are also cut off at the corners. Oh, okay. These are some tips on how you can use the rubber band. So you can use it to strap your drawing materials, or if you are not using it, you can put it on the back cover. So that's what I'm going to do right now. This is removable. So this sketchbook, it's handmade. And the paper, you can see here there's this artistical imprint. So it's not just Fabriano, it's Fabriano Artistical. This first page is actually one sheet of watercolor paper that is glued to the hardcover. And the hardcover has a very nice textured rubbery feel to it. And this paper, it's really thick. It feels like cardstock to me. So here it's glued, so you cannot open it wide. But for subsequent pages, you can just lay the sketchbook flat like this. The binding, it's excellent. Because the paper is so thick, it's 300 GSM. Every signature uses only two sheets of paper. You can see they have this little this little gap here in the spine that lets you open the sketchbook flat. 
This is cold press paper with texture and from what I can see the texture on the front and back of the paper they are quite similar so you can expect similar results while you are drawing and painting on both sides. And this is the sound of 300 GSM paper. 56 pages is a good number of pages. If this has even more pages, it's going to make it so thick. So this is a good size and good thickness. Now for the other sketchbook that uses 50% cotton paper, the paper weight is only 200 GSM. So even though it has more pages at 72 pages, it's actually thinner compared to the thicker paper. Build quality seems to be excellent as well. Same cutoff corners. Now this paper is actually bright white compared to the off-white that is here. You can choose different paper weights, you can choose different paper color, the surface texture uh, from the Covell website. These are the sketchbooks currently available for sale on their website. From what I can see, they are all A5 size or in portrait format. There are so many options here because you can choose between white or off-white paper, cold press, hot press, 50%, 100% cotton. All right, um, for the 100% cotton sketchbook, that is US $44 which is pricey, but this price is actually reasonable because when I make my own customized 100% cotton sketchbook, it comes up to around the same price. So I know this price is reasonable and competitive. For the 50% cotton sketchbook, it's US $36. The prices here do not include shipping because these are shipped from Italy. So if you're interested to find out more details about these sketchbooks, you can check out the link in the video description below. The next sketchbook I want to show you is the Etcher sketchbook that I do not have in hand because this is not out yet. The company that makes this sketchbook is Etcher Lab from Australia. They are going to release these sketchbooks on Kickstarter on the 3rd of April 2019 and that is one of the reasons why I'm making this video today so that if you are interested you can get in on the deal because these sketchbooks they are made with 100% cotton watercolor paper as well. Here's a product photo I got off their website. The cover looks nice, has rounded corners and pages, comes with an elastic band. The paper is available in hot press and cold press at 200 GSM. There's no mention of the company that actually makes the paper though. These sketchbooks are also available in different sizes. To find out the pricing, you can visit their Kickstarter page, which at the time of this video should already be up. I read somewhere on their website, they say that if the campaign is successful, they will sell some of the excess sketchbooks through their websites. Anyway, all the links are in the video description below. So it looks like the sketchbook can be open flat, which is great. This means you can draw and paint across two pages easily. In addition to the actual sketchbook that Actual Lab is going to make, they are also going to make the perfect sketchbook later this year. The perfect sketchbook is actually a 100% cotton watercolor paper sketchbook that was made by my friend Erwin Lien and a local Singapore company called Bind Artisan a few years ago. This is the original, the first perfect sketchbook. This is a small size sketchbook and uses an elastic band which has since lost its elasticity. That's why I don't like this thing. Anyway, this was rather popular. It was sold out and they made the second version which is much larger and this one uses Fabriano artistical paper so the paper quality is really fantastic the binding is excellent you can lay down the sketchbook flat no problem at all the cover has a nice texture rounded corners here decked edges for the paper and this sketchbook is quite Thick and it's also quite big so if you want to draw really large pieces this is uh, quite nice to draw on. Availability of the perfect sketchbook is always on and off so even if you want to buy this this may not be available for sale so if you cannot find this you can always check out the other options that I have mentioned in this video. 
Next up, we have the Academy Sketchbooks. Academy is a local company here in Singapore and they make really high quality sketchbooks that are leather bound. So here I have this landscape A5 sketchbook that is made with Fabriano Rosa Spina paper. This sketchbook also has decade ages and you can see this leather cover, it's really thick. There is a strap to hold the covers together. This sketchbook has 60 pages. Now Fabriano Rosa Spina paper is actually print making paper. This paper, it's off white. It's 220 GSM. This is quite thick. This is made with 60% cotton content. So this is not 100% cotton paper, but when it comes to using watercolor on this, the performance is similar to those top quality 100% cotton watercolor paper. I really enjoy drawing and painting on this. This paper texture is not exactly cold press. It's more like fine grain textured paper. You can get very nice granulation on it as well. And the colors, they blend very nicely into each other. Because the paper is off white, it's a bit creamy. It would make your sketch look a bit warmer. This sketchbook is from the Heritage series and this Academy sketchbook on the right side is from the Somerset series that uses 100% cotton watercolor paper made by Saunders Waterford. The pages here are cut straight. The leather cover here is very thick as well. That's the leather ribbon. The corners are rounded off. The leather texture is really nice. There are 46 pages in this sketchbook. The paper weight is 190 GSM. I haven't started using this yet, but with 100% cotton Saunders Waterford paper, you can expect the quality to be top notch as well. The downside to this two sketchbook is they don't open totally flat, so they can open wide enough, but you can see that there is always the the curvature, the book covers will always want to close up. So this is wide enough for my liking. This is a new sketchbook, so it's not going to open that wide. After you use it for a few times, it's going to open wider, but you can still see the curvature. These sketchbooks are available in different sizes and formats. The pricing is on the higher side. These are made in Singapore and the local price for this Imperial Super Octavo size. This is slightly larger than A4. This is 103 Singapore dollars. And this A5 landscape, this is 97 Singapore dollars. At the time of this video, it seems like they are having a 30% discount sale going on so now may be the right time to get these sketchbooks the pricing doesn't include shipping so if you want to find out the shipping cost you have to email the guy who makes this sketchbook the contact information is in the video description below now these are expensive sketchbooks but quality has a price this also happens to be the most premium high quality sketchbooks among all the sketchbooks you see in this video. The next sketchbook I have here is one of my old time favorites. This is the Cardi Papers sketchbook that is handmade in India. It has some sort of cardboard cover and watercolor paper has decade ages. This looks really cool. I like how raw and authentic this sketchbook looks and feels. The colors, they reproduce quite vibrantly on the paper. I'm not sure about the paper weight. I cannot remember exactly, but this paper is thick enough for you to layer multiple layers of washes, heavy washes. This paper is very durable. The paper that I have here in this sketchbook is the cold press paper. There is this grid like sort of texture on the paper. And as you can see, this paper can produce very beautiful granulation with the right paint. Very obvious, very textured granulation. Some people may not like the obvious pattern of the texture though. Because this is handmade paper, you can expect some inconsistency with the quality. 
On some pages, the sizing is fantastic. The colors reproduce very vibrantly, but on certain pages where the sizing um, is not that good, the water and the paint would appear to soak into the paper and that makes the colors less vibrant. And in this case here, I can even see the paper. It looks like it's above the colors. So on these two pages where the sizing is not that great, the colors, they appear to be a bit washed out. This sketchbook is available in different sizes. I cannot remember the exact pricing, but you can find that out through the links in the video description below. Overall, I really enjoyed myself drawing and painting in this sketchbook, despite the inconsistencies in quality on some pages. The last sketchbook I have here is this watercolor sketchbook that is made by SPD, the Society of Physical Disabled here in Singapore. This is about pump size hardcover, very rough, um, durable hardcover, rounded corners. It has 52 pages of 100% cotton watercolor paper. This is the elastic band, which is now very loose. There's the option to stamp text on the cover in either silver or gold, or you can do without this and just have a blank cover front and back. There's no mention of the brand of paper that's used here, except it's made with 100% cotton content. The quality is fantastic. It can handle watercolor really well. These are some sketches that I drew in 2015. I still remember this sketchbook very fondly. The binding is excellent and you can open the sketchbook flat. And this is the ribbon. Right at the back, there is this pocket to put your stuff. The price for this sketchbook is 35 Singapore dollars, which is around US $26 at the time of this video. And at this price for this quality hardcover front and back, 52 pages of 100% watercolor paper, I think it's worth the money. And also you are supporting people with disability, which is a good thing. This price doesn't include shipping, so you have to find out the shipping cost by contacting them. Contact information is in the video description below. If you are a regular on my channel, you may know that I have many customized sketchbooks made by SPD. I would give them the watercolor paper and they would buy them into sketchbooks for a fee. So this particular one, was made with Lana Aquarel watercolor paper. The paper quality is excellent and their binding quality is fantastic. I mean, this cover, these are some of the best sketchbooks that I have. And this one here, this was made with Arches Hot Press watercolor paper. Again, the paper quality and the binding, fantastic. This is one of the latest ones that I have made. And this was made uh, with Indigo Art Papers, 100% handmade watercolor paper. The quality is actually very similar to Cardi Papers. Whenever possible, I would support them by engaging their book binding services. So these are the sketchbooks that are made with 100% cotton watercolor paper. Of the ones that I have used, I really enjoy using them. It's very satisfying to draw and paint in them. If you want the most affordable one and you happen to be in Singapore, that would be the SPD sketchbook. If you want to customize your own sketchbook, you can get SPD to customize. Just bring them your paper. If you want a very premium sketchbook, a sketchbook that makes you smile each time you open up the pages, check out the Academy Leather Bound Sketchbooks. And if you want something you can buy easily, maybe check out the Covell Sketchbook Pro. If you know of other companies or brands that make sketchbooks with 100% cotton watercolor paper, do let me know in the comment section. I would love to find out. I'm sure other people would love to find out as well. So that's all for today's video. If you have any questions, let me know in the comment section below. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video. Bye.